Meg the Stallion finally drops picture of her foot. That was shot. Me and the Notification Gang would like to invite everybody to come join us Monday through Thursday, 9.20 to 10 o'clock for Morning Coffee, where we discuss the events of the prior day and also just talk mess about stuff. See you then. Oh, Black Dynamite, I wish it was that simple, but this is much bigger than you and me. Hey, little mama. It may be bigger than you, and it may be bigger than me, but it ain't bigger than you and me. Can you dig it? BBN, Jack Frost. What's up, party people? All right, so, yeah. So, apparently, Megan Thee Stallion has decided that she's going to show everybody the actual gunshot wound. Okay, so, real quick, a couple things we want to say here. First, Meg, BBN, Network, Jack Frost, we love you, all right? So, I get it. We're going to say certain things, do certain things. You're going to feel a certain way about it. Believe me, I 100% understand if you want to get upset or whatever the case is about any jokes that anybody made, myself or anyone else included, um, except for the jokes, <laughs> there's some of those jokes I don't get with. Like, she's a she's a chick, y'all. She's a female. Like, all the other jokes, I'm probably like, okay, that might be funny. But the jokes that people are making alluding to the fact that you might not be a woman, that's crazy. With that all being said, also, I do not know any of these to be facts or non-facts. <laughs> I just want to throw that out there also. But, just so we can be clear, Meg... You cannot get upset at the public, at your adoring public, or your hating public, whichever public you're talking about specifically. But you cannot get upset at the public if you yourself decide that you don't think it's important to put out information on a public event. Now, I just want to break this down real quick. Um, often people when they're in the, the, the eye of the public they're like they want to have their um they want to have you know their private life and that's totally 100 understandable don't get this confused uh i got a situation now where i got people talking about i tried to kill my daughter or some weirdo shit like you don't never know like niggas they will make up the craziest lies i'm just saying so the, the i did not try to kill my daughter my daughter comes on the show <laughs> actually every once in a while just so we could be clear um check out the tonight show with jack frost and morning coffee um, my daughter pulls up every once in a while so no n nobody tried to hurt her do my, hurt my daughter at least i haven't anyway with that being said meg the stallion you cannot be a public figure have something happen publicly and decide that you do not want to speak on it and then get upset when the vlogs, the blogs, the whoever, the bogs, the, 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 the whoever decide to hypothesize what could have possibly happened. Nobody's throwing hate at you, homegirl. I mean, I'm not. I don't know what anybody else is doing. But um, if you are going to not tell us what happened and it's a public event, we're going to speak on it. You are now famous. This is what comes with it. I'm just telling you. Uh, with all that being said, so they showed the gunshot wound, and it looks like she got shot in the back near the heel or near the ankle. I'm not 100% sure because um, for everybody that don't know, often they have to make a second hole in you to dig out the bullet. They don't stop believing these movies. They don't always go into the actual hole to dig the bullet out. Sometimes they have to cut you open somewhere else in order for them to be able to dig the bullet out of you. So that's what it looked like what possibly could have happened in Meg's case. I don't know if she got shot in the ankle or she got shot in the lower part of her foot. But it does look like they had to, you know, dig around to try to root out whatever was in her foot. So, all right. So now we know. For a bona fide fact, Meg the Stallion at least had one shot foot that she was shot in. She didn't have to spread her toes or any of those other... <laughs> um, things that people were saying um, Leave it down in the comments I want to know what y'all guys think about this um, The gunshot wound specifically um, Once again we don't know what entirely happened We do not know if um, uh, I don't know We don't know entirely what happened All we know is that uh, a gun went off And Meg Thee Stallion got hit I mean everything else is jokes at this point And just 
you know, people just coming up with their own theories, theorizing. That's all That's all we're doing at this point. If a couple of us hit the mark, it's just because we're good at theorizing. If some of us don't, then we just don't. And some of us is just making jokes. Because to be perfectly honest with you, that could have been a couple of couples. You understand know what I'm saying? Little ass Tory Lanez dating Meg Thee Stallion. Next thing you know, they have kids. You don't know if the kids is going to be... You know, uh, part of the Wizard of Oz remake Or if they're gonna be in the WNBA Or possibly the NBA You have no idea Anyway, leave it down in the comment section I wanna know what you guys think about this How angry should Meg be about all of this? Should she be angry? Did she take too long to, like, let people know what happened? Because at the end of the day The media is gonna talk and so are the fans Did she take too And it, and also, I just wanna know Just your opinion Is she taking all of this a little bit too, like, personal? Like, at the end of the day I, I'm no one to tell anybody what to take personal Because I take a ton of shit personal But is she taking this a little bit too personal? I mean, I don't know I know she's hurt, she got shot Um... She's a, I, I would love to say a petite woman, but she is not, but she is definitely a woman and all woman and uh, she got shot. So we got to, I want to know what y'all guys think about this. Anyway, leave it down in the comment section. Like, comment, subscribe, join the notification gang, hashtag Bronx Boomers. Let's get it. I love y'all. Take care of each other. Hug the kids for me. I haven't forgotten about you. And that's all I got on this one. I'm out.